my taxes, I'm too turned up. No, I ain't gonna do my taxes, I'm too turned up. Oh shit. Hey, sweetness, how you doing today? Pretty good, handsome, how are you? <laughs> oh, bitch, why are you doing all that? I look beautiful, honey. Joshua. What the hell are you doing? And why are you in here looking like Bing Brainers from Holiday Heart? Well, you must know I'm auditioning for a role where they're looking for a King Amaya Scott type of character. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is so funny? You auditioning? Yeah, my. <laughs> I want in on the job. Oh, are you serious? Very. You hate drag. You know this. This ain't you, bruh. Come on. You remember in theater how you used to hate how they always used to some type of way write you in to do drag and you absolutely hated it even though you was really good at it? Yes, I understand what you're saying and I hear you, but all the greats did drag on television in their early careers and I'm trying to be great. I'm trying to play the game, bitch, okay? Martin Lawrence did it, Eddie Murphy, Tyler Perry, just to name a few. Okay, I understand that, but you know there's a million ways to skin a cat, okay? Hmm. There, that means there's more than one road than dressing drag to become successful in Hollywood. And why does all black men have to dress drag in order to be successful in Hollywood anyways? See, this is exactly why Dave Chappelle quit and moved to that farm in Cleveland somewhere. That's one way of looking at it. And of course, nobody wants to be put in a box. I don't want to be the black gay stereotype in Hollywood. Exactly, and if you're gonna do this shit, then you gotta do it. I mean, I see way more bigger roles for you, brother. Like, give me a second. Mm -hmm. I got it, like the gay Sterling K. Brown from This Is Us. Oh. Oh. I like that. Sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Classy, mm -hmm. respectable. And strong. But Xavier, I can be strong and a black man and have on dress and heels and do drag. Plus, I'm good at drag. People like seeing me in it. Okay, that's... That's debatable. But... Mm. They asked for an Amaya Scott King type character for this, Joshua. I don't know what you're trying to say, Xavier. Well, what I'm saying is that Amaya Scott King actually looks like a woman. And I do too. She was once a man, or, or careful. is a man, or slippery slope. I don't down it. I don't know exactly. Exactly, you get the point. I don't. I don't okay. at all. So my point is that mm -hmm. get my to it She is mm -hmm. looks like a woman. Yeah, and you very much so look like a, a DC very... Marvel character, <laughs> like Wonder Woman or Catwoman, sure. or Harley Quinn. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, without the breast and boot and butt. Don't need them. Face is all I need. Okay. Yeah. That's all I need to get any man that I want in this world. And that's what and I you have. Are, you got it, Joshua. Don't touch me. You are trying to be offensive. I'm not trying care. to be yes, offensive. Are. I was trying to be honest with you. trying to be Joshua, loyalty. Not... It's something that we don't have right now. Well, there's nothing to be loyal to. I'm yes, telling you the truth. Is. There's nothing softly no, something not. about you besides I'm maybe I'm very your supple, voice. bitch. This whole body is supple. That's fucking offensive. I'm tired of that bullshit. You don't tell me what's supple. Your supple and my definition of supple are totally fucking different, asshole. On the straightest of days, the straightest of days, right? Days are straight. Yeah. If I want them to fucking be, bitch, let okay. me make my goddamn point. Okay. You done? I'm done. 